Welcome to Huntington. We do trains and we do limestone and we're going to be working with a lot of both in the next few months. So like I said, Sonny Cutrus and the crickets released I Fought the Law and the Law won in December of 1960. And 12 years later, in October of 1972, Congress overcame Richard Nixon's veto to enforce and enact the Clean Water Act. Now, several decades later, the city of Huntington is breaking ground on the final three projects of our long-term control plan. This will fulfill our legal obligations under our agreed order with IDEM signed in September of 2007 by Mayor Terry Abbott. Several administrations have moved the ball forward on this. And with us today, we also have Mayor Steve Updike, Mayor Brooks Fetters, and we also want to recognize Councilman Joe Blumicky and all the other elected officials that weren't able to be with us here today who helped move this forward incrementally year after year along the way. This work began before this administration and that credit is due to those who moved it forward and put us here today. But while it began before this administration, I have the distinct pleasure of leading our community across the finish line in fulfillment of my chief campaign commitment to finish out this long-term control plan. And so again, today as we gather together, I express my personal thanks to city council members and Board of Public Works and safety members across administrations, the previous mayors who are in attendance with us today and those who've gone on ahead of us, our city staff and council that have seen this through over the years, the team at Lock Mueller Engineering, Atlas Construction, and many of the other contractors who are working with us on this today. So thank you again. Welcome to Huntington. We look forward to working with you once again and seeing these projects through. Uh, let's do some pictures and turn some dirt. 